Hello, and welcome to the Orbit Reader 20 Connecting with an iOS Device video. Today, I will be going over how to pair your Orbit Reader 20 with any iOS device over Bluetooth. Using your Orbit Reader 20 with any iOS device provides you both braille feedback and the ability to type and control the iOS device with your Orbit Reader 20. If you are using a version of iOS 10.2 or earlier, you must set the Orbit Reader 20 to RB18 emulation. Do this by going to the menu, then navigate to emulate, and then select RB18. By default, the Orbit Reader 20's pair settings is set to just works, so the device is ready to pair with the iOS device. To check that the device is set to just works, go to the menu, then navigate to pair, and then ensure that just works is selected. Now, on the iOS device, go to Settings, Bluetooth, and turn Bluetooth on if it is not on already. Now go back to the Settings page and select Accessibility. Depending on your iOS version, the Accessibility menu may be found under the main page or under General. In the Accessibility menu, select Voice Over, and then Braille. Look for the name of your Orbit Reader 20 unit in the list. The name should include the last four digits of the serial number. Once you have found your unit, select it. Now go back one window to the VoiceOver settings. Turn on VoiceOver. Your Orbit Reader 20 will now connect to your iOS device. For a list of general navigation and commands while using the Orbit Reader 20 on the iOS device, please check out our online user guide at www.orbitresearch.com slash support slash orbit dash reader dash 20 dash support. This has been a quick tutorial on connecting to your Orbit Reader 20 with an iOS device. For more videos and information on how to use your Orbit Reader 20, check out and subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.